in group C answering 22 questions the chance of error of a question are 2 so you can answer 2 questions wrong so in group B you are answering 25 questions and the chance of error is 5 questions in group A you are answering 8 questions while the chance of error is answering 4 wrong questions now adding all the marks together deleting the negative markings giving us 121.5 so this 121.5 is above the sweet spot because we know the sweet spot is 120 so you can write it down take a notebook write it down you can pause the video and can write it down on your own so let me tell you one thing in group C answering 22 questions the chance of error of a question are 2 so you can answer 2 questions wrong so in group B you are answering 25 questions and the chance of error is 5 questions in group A you are answering 8 questions while the chance of error is answering 4 wrong questions now adding all the marks together deleting the negative markings giving us 121 so this 121.5 is above the sweet spot because we know the sweet spot is 120 120